Hey guys, how's it going? It's Ability here, and in this video I'm going to be using the PVM team for the first time since I've made their sets, and I want to run Climb's Private Suite. And the reason that I chose this dungeon is because it's a level 200 dungeon, and I'm on the Paragon step of Vulbistophus, so if you guys are not familiar, Paragon of Power is a resource that is dropped by every level 200 dungeon boss, and it has a 0.7% chance dropping for the panda who is currently chance and has 250 prospecting, which is a lot. So it's a very low percent drop rate, but all the level 200 bosses drop it, including climb. So I'm going to run it just for the chance of dropping Paragon on one of my characters. Um, I actually just did Silarg, and I didn't check if anyone dropped it. No, okay, so no one dropped it for Silarg. Okay, so I'm going to run Climb here, and I decided that I'm actually going to make this a longer video and include the rooms leading up, because this is the first video I've done for the PVM team, so I kind of want to get you guys um, familiar with them, and I'll put in the timeline below when the boss fight starts. So if you're not interested in the first rooms, you can skip right to that, no problem. And now I'm going to jump into it so the video is not too long, and let's get inside. And Harrigant, what is that weak to? Two Harrigants. Neutral res. So maybe I will go... Let's see. I will... I'm thinking of going melee strength. Um... Yeah, let's try it. Let's go melee strength. Melee strength, and then on the panda, let's go tank. And let's position everyone. So that's the first Harrigan to go. So ability. And Cuda can go back here. The IOP is melee, so. Panda will go here, IOP will go here. Hmm. Yeah, I'll figure it out. Okay. So for the panda, what I'm going to do actually is this, this, and I'm going to pick up the IOP, so I want to save one AP. So I will do this, this, stain, loser, and Archim. There we go. So now they are locked. And for ability, I'm probably not going to be using bombs so much in this fight. But I don't really have anything better to do on this turn. Did I miss something? Yeah, I did. So there we go there. And let's check their resistances. 30%, 1%, negative 30%. I don't think I can reach him though. I don't think I can reach anything except for the punch up. So let's go for him. I will do this conjuration here interruption. So pretty decent damage for 1%. And now the Harrogant. So let's see, I am in a strength set. So I want to, oh, that's gonna go to the IO. I mean to the Panda, that was dumb. It says that's gonna heal him. Why? That oh, whatever. Alright, so it looks like they're possibly reflecting damage or something. Don't know, not too familiar with this area. Brandy, don't need to use that. Alright, so let's focus this guy here. Although he's almost dead. And yeah, we'll do it anyways. I wish I could put that on the Heliotrope, but they are out of line of sight. Alright, so let's do this. Pick the eye up back up. 
quite laggy. And now on abilities turn, let's do bomb boosting. Lots of actions per turn here. There we go. Now, are any of these... Oh, okay, he's negative to agility. So let's do this. stuff I thought I had. That's no, okay. And then we can run this way here. Wow, that's a lot of MP. Oof. Where's that damage coming from? Alright, so we can do this. No crit, unfortunate. Bit of rage. sword of eye up there kill that one does that walk me no so let's do this 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 him back up. Place him here. Pull him in. The eye up back up. There we go. So now ability is here with this punch up. So what I'm actually going to do is I can do this. There we go. And now, this is going to be one off, isn't it? Yeah, that's one range off. Oh, he goes next anyways. I'll just pass. Okay, so it's the Eliotrope's turn. So I am going to... Oh, he locks it now. Do this. Distribution. I was going to do something else, but... Plans have changed. And then we will do this. Heal the panda a little bit. Kill that thing. And now let's see if we can kill this as well. 2k crit there. Get a rage. So we won't be able to kill, but the panda will. Well, technically not the panda, but... Heal them a little bit. And let's chuck it in the bomb line. Should be the end of that fight. Yep. Nice. No casualties in the first fight, that's always good. Dropped a Harrigan eye. Is any of this expensive? Mm, not really. Dumple, so what's a dumple? Negative two, agility, right? Yeah. So the IOP, so let's heal a little bit, get the initiative order correct. There we go. All good there. And I will go, I'll go ranged Omni here so I can use agility spells. And I'll put this guy here and here here and here should be good okay so dumple first and then punch up here six seven can't use waterfall turn one so what i'll do here is actually place that there and then we'll do this get him ready to be one shot
I'm probably not going to be using bombs much in these fights, so I'm actually not even going to place them. There we go. Oh, the IOPS going before the Heliotrope. Whoops. It's not supposed to happen. Alright, so I'm Omni. Can't use Conquest turn 1. He's negative to Agi, he's negative to Intel. So what I can do is... Oh, I can't do that. Well, I'll just hit in Strength, even though it doesn't really hit too hard on either of them. I thought the Aleotrope was going to go before the IOP, but he's missing a little bit of HP. Doesn't matter though, we can still one bop this guy. Do this. And let's see if we can one shot him. Yep. Uh, I put the portal in a bad spot because now I can't hit this guy. Well, give the panda some AP. Close the portals up and put focus on ability. Alright, so this guy is unmovable. So what I'm going to do here is... I wonder if I can take off his unmovable state. Nope. Okay. Oh, only one of those went through. Oh, God. Just do this. And we can go back for the second one. Mm. You know what though, because I'm gonna, eh, yeah, we'll do it. I'm probably gonna hit myself with the eye op. So I was planning on shielding, but it's probably not even worth it. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Grab that extra AP. It's gonna hurt me. Oh well, I'll be healing at the same time. There we go. And then we can extraction and leak pie. All right, so I didn't even need the eye up there. So this guy is negative to air. Hmm, is this evil to do? Oh, he's got ivory, it's not evil. I am sorry, Panda. Truly. I can probably kill this thing. The two destructive rings. Right? Oh. Did neither of those crit? So let's see. Stretching is not too useful right now. And that will link wrong, so what I'm going to do is... this kind of a waste and that's good enough and now I am going to bring this guy back over here and pick him up oh he might be able to swap with the eye up here maybe should have put him there nope we're good Does anyone need heals? Yeah, I have needs a little bit. Heal him before the fight ends. And what we'll do this. So let's see, I have turn. This guy's negative to chance. Oh, I have 3 MP. I must have taken it. Um, okay. Well, I will just do this. And... This. That is a lot of damage for a 3 AP spell. Anyone need heals? A little bit on the panda. 
that should be GG. Cool. Everyone finished pretty much full HP. No casualties still. Always good. So in this room, the IOP should probably go range strength. And that should be good. Right? Yeah. Okay. So let's see which one goes first. That one goes first. That's kind of annoying that it goes first. Um, all right, and let's just make sure he's in the strength range set. Yep, and we're good. Initiative is all set. All right, so that's pushback damage, so it hurts a lot, but. I'm actually going to try and, um, what am I saying? I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to try and put my back to both of them because I'm hoping that the IOP will just one-shot them. So that is my plan. And I will, yeah, I'm going to be hurting myself quite a bit, so I'll do that. So this thing's going to hurt me quite a lot. 724, it's actually not bad. Um, yeah, there's really no point in me making bombs. So I'll just do this. And pass. And we will set the eye up. Oh, he swapped. He swapped twice. How did he get away from the panda? Am I locked? I have two MP? Very annoying. But you know what? It's not gonna matter. So the IOP is going to deal a large amount of damage here. Should I double soy? Yeah. There we go. There we go. 2700 on a crit. If the first one crit, it would have done like a thousand more damage. Oh, that thing wants revenge. Oh, I have so little MP. Which one goes next? This one goes next. What I'm actually gonna do here is just banish it. There we go. Alright, we will get rid of these. No one's really low on HP. Wish I had one more MP. Or Ruse. Eh, oh well. We'll just hit. his turn let's see I do want to kill that thing hmm. it's actually harder to kill than I thought oh I have such little MP again man that keeps happening
So the IOP. I'll do this. And then he's pretty low. I'll use pressure to finish him off. And full pass. This thing keeps getting away from me somehow. Not sure why. Or how I mean. Okay, I'll do this. Double boom. Should be good. And now ability can heal Panda. And we'll just hit. Yeah, it didn't get away this time. Okay. There we go, there's the end of that fight. All right, another good one. Hopefully this dungeon will be a breeze. Inner Knight didn't get any drops, poor guy. Gotta run through the dressing room. There we go, quite laggy. Putch up, what is that week two? I'm always checking what the double mob is week two, fire. Okay, so we'll go tank panda. We'll go Omni Ranged IOP, Intelligence Rogue, and Agility Eliotrope, of course. So, which one goes first? That leather ball? He's gonna push me so far away. Can't avoid it though. So, I'll go there, there. Make sure the IOP gets in. We'll do this. This looks good to me. What was that sneeze noise? I never noticed that before. Oh, he's going for the Elio. Okay. So that punch up goes next. Punch ups are very oddly spaced. Hmm. What if I did. I don't know if this is going to work. Because I don't think I can cast this twice. No, I can't. So I'll just save the AP. And we will double bomb that one. There we go. Nice, he walked there. Cool. So, let's see that thing. Negative to air. Oh, the initiative order is all weird. Set up Inner Knight. Let's do this. This. Distribution. And we'll hit twice. That's good damage, not even through a portal. Alright. So here, we're just gonna buff up a little bit. Uh, I could have hit through that portal, that was a little bit of a misplay, but it doesn't matter so much. Alright, so this is going to be quite large damage. To the panda included, but he's got ivory. There we go, that was a one shot and then a 4k. And let's see, this is negative to intel. Yeah, we'll go tumult. Poor panda. This guy can never catch a break. 2500, 1700, large damage. Oh, Elio took damage that turn. Oh, he's got tons of MP. And I think that's what his damage is based on. So this guy's almost dead. This guy as well, sort of. So let's... Oh, he's unmovable though. Well, that changes my plan. We will do this. 
and shield. So that guy and that guy. I think it's turn two, so I'm on a cloudy downturn. So I think the best thing for me to do is to just set up. How many cast per turn is this? Please be three, two. All right. There we go. And now ability can set up the rest of that. My bombs are pretty far away. Oh, I come out there. Unfortunate. Mm, I don't really need to do anything else. Panda's about to take some whopping damage, so I will heal him and then let the eye up one shot him. All right. So let's see. That's on 734. So I will do a tumult. There we go, 4,000 there. And now we can do a double sort of IOP. 2,200. And we can do that again, and then a pressure if he lives. There we go. That was a fun fight. The IOP got some good AoEs in there. The IOP probably did like 99% of the damage in that entire fight. Nice, so we're at the boss. So I'm going to greet people that skipped the video. All right, guys, we are here at the boss. And I actually just died to the boss, so I'm cutting that out. I tried to do idols, however, it didn't work out very well. So we're going to switch it up. And I'm going to look at some other achievements that I can do. Never a finish next to an enemy. Uh, that's sort of doable and Nomad. Let's go for Never Finish. Let's try and go for both. I'll go Chance Panda. Mm, propulsion. Eh. Yeah. Looks good there. Ability. Omni ranged for the IOP, I think. And we should be good. Let's go. All right. Let's make sure everyone gets in here. Who are we missing? Ability. Okay. So never finish next to an enemy and deal damage. I think that thing was negative to chance. Let's we'll see how this pans out. Is this one negative to chance? Yes. Okay. Am I locked? Yes. Can't really do much though. So I will just hit the Astro. No crit. There we go. And I will use all my MP. So let's see, this one's negative to agility. What is the poison that I have? Oh, it's just a poison in general. Okay. So I definitely want to use bombs in this fight. And I think I'll start them off here. And we'll use all of my MP. Oh, that thing's gonna move me. That's not good. Now I can't go through portals. Um. Alright. I'll go here. Two thousand five hundred and one hit, pretty decent. Wow, 
That poison hit a lot. Okay. So this guy's negative to chance, which is not my strong suit. I think I just buff. Nah. Let's hit. It's more fun. Uh, can't really do too much. Um, we'll just do this. Alright, I was going to be poisoned. That was probably not a good turn. Let's see if we can kill that thing. Didn't kill it. Man, low crits. Not much that I can do here. Yep. Okay. So who needs heals? Eliotrope needs him pretty badly. Should I just focus bombs though? I think so. Yep, we're just gonna full buff these bombs here. There we go. So now it's the Eliotrope's turn. Can I kill that thing? Probably not. Oh, what is that? Okay then, we're going to just self buff. Why did that happen? There we go, coalition, focus, heals, this thing. You got these mampy? There we go. Oh, was that poison? 1800, are you kidding me? Do I have intimidation? Of course not. I'm gonna have to release this guy anyway, so might as well do it before I hit. Hit him. 3,200. I bet I'm poisoned. Do I have to. No, I can just kill him like this. I wonder if he'll die from that poison. Oof. No, it wasn't even that bad. Haven't failed either achieve yet is pretty good. Terror, is that? Yep. Let's do this. we go. Can I one-shot climb? Probably not. We sure can try though. Yeah, not even close. Um, should I do it irrationally? Yeah. Let's take one of Climb's actions per turn. Make him kill the irrationally. So let's see, the IOP goes next. That's Portal 1. I am going to do this. So then that's portal two. Uh, 
I messed it up. Okay. Well. I'm probably dead anyways from poison. Is this enough? Yes, that's an uncharged draft, by the way. Pretty nuts. All right, we have still managed to keep up both challenges. Doing pretty well, if I do say so. We're gonna use this summon to vault him now. And I just gotta make sure not to kill him without using my MP. There we go. Three, one. So we can do this. Right? I think so. And this will be this will be GG. Yeah. Nice. There we go, I think. I think I got them both. As long as I... Yep, there we go. Got them both. Pretty happy with that. No Paragon, though. Shoot. That would have been the icing on the cake if we got four Paragons right there. <laughs> well, I hope you guys enjoyed this. That was um, the first dungeon that I've uploaded with the PVM team. I'll likely be doing more, especially because I still need four Paragons. So if you guys enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like, and I'll catch you guys next time.